Hello, I'm Clark Nelson. And I'm Stephanie Lane. Today we cover the vigilante craze sweeping the nation, growing each and every day. Are these people truly heroes or simply just getting in the way? Washington man, everyday man, and a young superboy. Whether it's for better or for worse, it would seem this craze is here to stay. All this and more when we return. I know what you've been up to. Changing the world in just another day in the park. You're playing with fire here, kiddo. It's time you own up to your actions and clear that conscience. Spill the beans. What kind of person are you? But I'm really nothing special. All right, let's start from the top. When was the first time you did one of these things? First time, man, it's so long ago. Well, I was at the university and uh, it was a nice day out, right in the middle of May. I remember walking up to the doors and seeing someone carrying a bunch of books. Thank you. That's when I got the idea. That's when it all came... So that's when this rebellious movement began, huh? I bet you didn't think about how far this would go, though, did you? No. No, I, I guess not. Have you seen the file we have on you? These incidents. You started causing them all over town, day after day. Didn't you? Uh, I guess so. It was slow at first, but then it just took off. It wasn't planned. It just sort of happened. What can you tell us about this one, then? Again, right time, right place. Oh, and I had a costume this time. I was just tossing out some trash when all of a sudden... Heads up! Trash bomb incoming! That's not trash. I guess that was the first time I gained a fan. These were all just the beginning, weren't they? None of us were ready for what happened next. I guess not. See, this is when you acquired your strange cult following, right? Uh, I guess so. I need to know everything. Just please take this one from the top. We don't have you in here because you're a nice person. I need answers. Well, I was walking home one day. Oh no, my baby, my baby! I guess that's when I started to get noticed. Gucci you go. Oh, thank you. What's your name? I'm just an everyday man who excels at the ordinary. You're not here because you saved a baby. You know, I know you have people on the outside. Tell us what you did. Confess. I don't know what you want me to say. Agent Z, tell them what we're holding him for. Wait. I guess you didn't really do anything, did you? I keep telling you. All right. I, um, I guess you're free to go then. Dang it. That was so stupid. It doesn't take much to be a hero. 
Even if you live an ordinary life, you can make the world a better place. The ocean needs my power. I must go. It's up to every one of us. After all, there really isn't any hero better than the everyday man. Now is there? I can understand how someone could look at him and see your typical five-year-old, but he's not. He's just not. It's like he has a sixth sense or something. He knows when you're in trouble. He knows when he's needed. He's just super. He's super boy. Coming this August. A documentary about an unlikely superhero. His life and his family. I remember the day we realized he was special. His sister needed to cross the street and we weren't there to help. Thank God Superboy was there to save the day. I just know he's gonna save the world. Someday. an emergency. I'm thirsty and I'd like some Kool-Aid. And, and you know what? Actually, wh while you're at it, can you bring me some drugs too? Do you know who I am? Idaho man called right after that. It was great. You guys remember when Washington woman broke up with Washington man? And he left a dead possum on her porch? <laughs> Screw you, Washington woman! Washington woman called Oregon woman that morning, so pissed off. Oregon woman made me go up there and clean that mess. <laughs> That's why New York woman and I have a working relationship. No relations outside of work. You know that's just because New York woman doesn't swing that way. Damn Democrats. Dude, Texas man, you gotta be like, more hip. Dude. That reminds me of that time Washington man got busted for marijuana after he locked his keys in his car and had to ask an officer for help. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. 
You are under arrest for possession of marijuana. Damn it, not again. It cost so much to bail him out. But it was worth it. We sure are going to miss you, Washington man. You will always be remembered. We loved you. This ride's going to suck. Hey, at least it's not as bad as that time Washington man got arrested for masturbating in front of that road crew. <laughs> <laughs> I am? No, that's just because New York woman doesn't explain that way. Democrats. Idaho man called right after that. It was great. I just really miss him. Morning so pissed off. Working woman made me go up there and clean that mess. Dude, Texas man, you gotta be like more hip. You are under arrest. Mm. For possession of marijuana. Damn it. No Welcome back. We are truly indebted to the brave citizens for the sacrifices they have made. They truly have changed the face of heroism. Everyday Man has shown us the power of kindness. Superboy has shown us that no matter your stature, you can always be super. Washington Man... He was weird. But our hearts will always be with Washington Man, and his legacy will always live on through us. From all of us here at EBX Studios, good night. Yeah, he really was weird. <laughs>